Hey there, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to do a quick review over a couple of gloves, the Springer's gloves and the Ranchworks Ironclad gloves. So let's get to it. Alright, so I want to review a couple of gloves. I've had a problem where every time I've got a pair of gloves, they just don't last. Like, no matter how much I spend on them, anywhere from, you know, the $5.99 all the way up to $20 plus, they all um, just they, they wear out on me quick. So I was looking for a more reliable glove. So I, I purchased three different pairs. I don't have the other pair of leather ones with me at the moment. But what I do have is these. Ironclad Ranch Works, and they are pretty much all leather except for a little bit of a um, stretchy vinyl, and it's got some rubber um, protect the knuckles, as well as it's got some uh, Kevlar lined um, areas as well. So these gloves I've had for about a year and a half, roughly, and they've been the best gloves I've ever had. Um, hands down. I paid like $25. I got them off, I believe off of eBay. I'll give you a link uh, for where they are. Um, but for a little bit more money that these cost, they're well worth it because they've lasted me so much longer. Um, here on this one, I haven't had any any uh, fatigue anywhere. So this this glove is actually still good. It, uh, man, it, it flexes and makes so that no matter what it is you're doing, I wear these for everything, yard work, working on uh, machinery, uh, grinding, um, just, just anything and everything, hammering, screwing, they, they, they're very flexible and um, they, they fit nice, they feel nice, they wash um, nice. This this glove, I guess because it's my left one, I use um, certain things a little more. Um, I've got a couple of uh, split outs, um, it's there you can see. Um, I've sewn one of these that had split, and I got another split there. So these these gloves are pretty much at the point where they're going to start breaking down even more, and uh, I need to replace them. So I I'm perfectly glad to to buy another pair of these because they've lasted so long, and um, knowing how well they have uh, worked with me, and yeah, definitely definitely a good glove. Another outstanding glove, but it's, it's a heavier glove, and it's probably more so um, for colder weather. Here in Georgia, you know, I'm, I've, I've gotten down to, what, 50 degrees so far here in the fall, and I, I haven't needed them. I tried wearing these the other day, but my hands were sweating so much that I, I, it, it's got to be uncomfortable. So they're a little, they're a little thicker, a little bulkier, and there's, it's got a combination of a leather palm, leather face, and then all this is um, some type of stretch material with Kevlar and, and big heavy duty rubber backing to protect your knuckles so if you bang it you're not going to hurt yourself. Um, so these, these are outstanding gloves, especially if you're going to do anything super heavy and in the cold. But again, like right now, with the temperature being anywhere between 50 and 70, these um, you can't wear them too long because your hands will start sweating. That's where these these will be better. But um, if you're working in a colder climate and um, outdoors, and then with heavy stuff, anything from you know using a shovel, um, heavy machinery, anything like that. I mean, these are even would be good for uh, dirt bike riding or riding on a motorcycle. Um, in, in the cold, so uh, they're nice. They they flex well, and you got pretty good maneuverability. But it's just they're they're heavier, and again in this in this temperature they get to be uncomfortable wearing. So, um, but they are. Um, I've not used these gloves much, so I can't really say about the durability. But they appear to be stitched and um, assembled very uh, very nicely. Very. Uh, uh, Strong, it's got double stitches everywhere. Um, 
and I guess it's got some kind of rating there for uh, protecting your hand. But again, these are Ringer's gloves, and this says 267 MD. I guess MD is probably medium, but uh, yeah, yeah, these are medium size nine. So, um, so Ringer's gloves. I'll put the link on there for this one as well. I think these are a little more money. They have these little, uh, you can see the um, uh, bubble dots help give you grip. This is just all leather, so um, got pretty good grip there. There was here on the tips, I think, some uh, of that um, Kevlar or some type of fabric there. Anyway, if you want, you want good gloves that, that last. I would say get these uh, ringers gloves, and then for everything general purpose, get these ironclad ranch work. You'll definitely appreciate and be glad you got something that's uh, so durable. Um, yep, I already buy these pair. So anyway, thanks for uh, tuning in. If you like this uh, review, then uh, please like and subscribe, and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Thanks.